is Dad Warren, along with Mum, Debbie, Brother Michael on the right, his best mate, Jeffrey. I've had so many people in the last few days asking me in the street, when are we going to see Jack Wilson again on the Australian Ninja Warrior course? Well, here he is. Frame sliding out. He's got to wedge himself in there. A bit sideways, but he seems to be gripping okay. One jolt, two jolts. Nicely done. Too easy. Too easy. Now the broken pipes. He's not waiting straight on. Stops halfway, which is not a bad move. Gets composure, trips but gets through. And after becoming the first to get through the pipes tonight, he now has a look at the swinging pegboards. Trying to work out a strategy. He's got a swing up there, then use the pegs to work his way across. It's all in the arms. He'll want to make the most of those biceps and keep the pressure off his forearms. OK, it's time to start moving those pegs, Jack. Just look behind here now. Look at all the fans in the crowd. Face paint, T-shirts, banners. Everybody knowing who this young man is. Let's go, Jackie boy. Let's go, Jack. Let's go, Jack. Now the transfer. Tosses away a peg. That's all right. There are three on this board if he needs them. He's being very careful and methodical, and still he's got the strength to keep those arms bent. See how he's using his legs to build up the swing, using his whole body, and you need to. That's the skill this bloke's got. Here he goes. Yes, he nails it. Jack Wilson on fire. Let's go, Jack. Let's go, Jack. Now onto the sky hooks, edging ever closer to the end of this semi-final course, but there's a long ways to go yet. Yes, he hooks on the first time. Now he's got to transfer to the second ring. Let's go, Chad! Let's go, Chad! This is a big challenge. He's got to lache across to the next ring. It is nearly two metres away. Oh, he's done it. What an athlete. Oh, beautiful dismount. And he points to the family. Mum and Dad couldn't be prouder. Now, time for the warped wall. We know he can do this, but the crowd still chants, beat the wall. He's up the wall. Takes a moment to enjoy it. But you are not finished yet, Jack. Not by a long way. This is where the heat's ended, but now the rubber hits the road in the semi. See him shaking his arms there. The fatigue is building, but the obstacles get a whole lot harder. None harder than this one, the iconic salmon ladder. It's so tough, Jack. Let's go, bros. He's testing the trampoline. He needs to bounce up to the bar, then muscle his whole body weight up not one, not two, but three rungs. Here he goes, he's on the bar. First time we've seen this this year. Up one, no, up half a one. He's corrected it. There's two, there's three. Let's go, bro. Now he needs to get onto the monkey bars, the floating monkey bars. Reach onto the next. Now I'm gonna take this monkey bar with him. Crosses over, finds the gap nice and easily. Not easy, Freddie. His arms will be burning. The fatigue is building and building. The dismount now. One last big jump. Gets the momentum up. There we go. He's off. He's made it. Two obstacles to go. The deadly ninja climbs his way up. He is gassed. And now the deadly ninja gets ready for the hourglass to tramp to rope. Now look out for this nasty tramp. Jack won't have seen one like this before. It's going to drop a long way. If he's not ready, it's going to cause him a big headache. Here he goes! Oh, well. Just like that, we knew that was a challenging part, but that was a brilliant run all the same, Jack Wilson. Absolutely superb. That even when you've got some of the best, you never know what's going to happen. The Deadly Ninja gave us our first real look at just how hard this course is. Each of these obstacles builds the fatigue. Each one is harder than the last. But this trampoline, it's not like the mini tramps earlier in the course. The webbing stretches. It drops three times further. See his knees collapse as he sinks into it? He needed to get them firm to get enough bounce to reach the bar. A sensational run comes to an end.